Howdy folks, welcome back to the Witcher 3 playthrough. We're looking for a girl. And a child's footprints. Who just ran out of here. We'll take that. Ba -da -ba -da 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 -da. She ran out of here. Ran this way, along with the blood. She went one window, out the other. Smart. Out of the end window? Yeah, she's smart. Okay. Can't jump that, can't run through it. Uh -huh. Gotcha. Hey, girl. Don't worry. I'm not going to hurt you. Calm down. I just want to talk to you. I got it wrong. I'm. Same as? Same as him! The bad man who killed everyone! Did he have two swords on his back? Not telling you nothing! Go away! Alright, enough. Tell me what happened here. I... I'll tell ye. I would. There was aunt here. Some spook. Uncle Silvermore said we'd best fetch a witcher. See so one came. Looked lost like you. But there were evil in his eyes. He forced the spook's head set. Uncle Silvermere were happy about something. He yelled and he cursed. And then he went to the barn and and <laughs> and what? Not sure. I I heard him screaming. Uncle Silvermere and the others. Then that that witcher he ran out of the barn, blood all over him, and anybody who well, all of them. One by one, with his sword like this. My mum and my brother too. <laughs> he let me go. I don't know why. And then he went that way, towards the circle where we leave gifts for the gods. I hid in the barn. Found this lion in the A. School of the Cat. Thanks. You've been a big help. What'll you do? Got any family around here? Me auntie lives in Oriton. I'll take you to her. But first I gotta see to this bad man. This doll's yours, right? I'll get close and stay put. Understood? Sit tight, kid. Well dang, this is actually pretty sad. This is a whole side if quest. Walk towards the circle, that'd be the place to start. This is an entire side quest. The stone circle. Need to look around. Footprints. Barely visible. Must be him. I legit can just blood still fresh. one shot them. He's close. Witcher, it's Letha, maybe. Is it Letha? No. Well, maybe it could be. Hello, Witcher. Nope. Well, well, small world. Hi, ma'am. Lost something. 
come all that way to give me my medallion? Thanks. Craft Solidarity is alive and well. <laughs> but our craft's reputation is on its last legs. Folk won't easily forget that massacre. Occupational hazard. Could have happened to any one of us. Well, what are you still doing here? I want to chat first, then we'll see. Take your seat. I'll stand. Now talk. Honorton, what happened? Come on, you know what happened. Know what they wanted to pay me for the lesson? Go on, guess. Not in the mood for guessing games. I knew you were no fun the minute I saw you. Twelve. Understand, pal? Twelve fucking crowns. Barely covers my potion ingredients. What had you agreed to? That several times over. But when it came time to pay up, ah, you know the routine. Oh, good sir, me young'uns are starving. There's a war on. Gods have mercy. Show some pity. Rings a bell, but that's no reason to kill. I'm not finished. I told them I wouldn't show pity. That if I didn't see gold, they'd wish they had the lesson back. They got these grim looks. Then the alderman spoke. Calm now, Master Witcher. Me and the lads, we hid some gold in the barn, so's the Baron's men wouldn't take it. Come, you'll get your coin right quick. I fell for it, like a fool. One of them chattered on while another jabbed me in the back with a pitchfork. So you decided to massacre the whole village? What would you have done? Gone to the local magistrate to file a complaint? I admit, I lost my temper. Lost it bad. I'm used to shit bounties, to the cheating, to them begging me for help and then spitting as I pass. But murder me? Just to save a few crowns? I'm supposed to protect horses like that? So I drew steel and didn't sheathe it till the ground was slick with blood. The girl, why'd you spare her? Cause, uh, it doesn't matter. Wouldn't have asked if it didn't talk. Reminded me of my sister. How I remember her from just before they took me away to the school of the cat. How is she now? Died about 10 years ago. Of old age. Well, we've had our little heart to heart, Witcher to Witcher. What now? He's fine. I ain't doing anything to you. Not my job to judge you. Ultimately, it's not my job to judge you. That's it? Not gonna lecture me? Make me promise to mend my ways? They call me the Butcher of Blaviken for good reason. I know how it is. Sometimes, sometimes heads just roll. Wait. I'm no cheap prick like those hayseeds. I owe you something. Here, directions to my stash. Take what you want. Thanks. No, thank you. Good luck on the path, wolf. Alright, I did the definitely the right option on that. Yeah, he didn't deserve to die. Neither did all the villagers, but to be fair, they were going to kill him. That's crazy. Why are we just sitting? <laughs> uh, okay, that might have been the end of a side quest as well. Or maybe I have to go look in the stash. Should get back to the kid. Oh no, I gotta Should escort her. her out. All right, take what you want. Yeah, new quest. Take all this stuff in case I ever need it. And keep moving. Ah, uh, dogs, I don't want to fight you. Alright. You're back! I saw, thought you'd not return. 
return. That he'd hurt you too. I'm fine. And you don't need to worry about him anymore. So, so you'll take me to my auntie's? It's, it's awful here. Sure thing. Let's go. Think, think I could ride on your shoulders? Huh. So long as you promise not to pull my hair. I promise. Then hop on up. Geralt actually is such a good guy. Goodness, ma'am. Millie, what are you doing here, you naughty girl? I, cause, back in the village, there's no... I'll explain. You run along and play a bit, all right? was a massacre in Honorton. No survivors. Well, except her. The gods. What happened? A bandit attack? You could say that. You'll look after her? Truth be told, you'd do better to take her with you. Funny. Used to be folk were afraid we'd take their kids. Used to be folk weren't so in need. Got four of me own grandkids. Used to be six, but we buried two last winter. Hard to live off naught but bark soup. Take this. Use it for food, and only food. If I come back and see you drinking... So much. The gods reward ye, Master Witcher, a thousand blessings. I was on my way. No, but, but why? Witcher's lot in life, always on the road, on the path. Will you come back and see me sometime? Hope so. Take care, kid. Millie! Come, child. We'll buy a bit of flour. Your aunt will whip up some pancakes. Sound good to ye? Dang, man. That's sad. That's actually pretty freaking sad. I bet somewhere around here is the post to travel from. Check, Recheck this notice board as well. It's full again. Alright, but we've been here before. Um, his stash is right up... Oh, that's... Actually, still not that close. I guess we'll go to Troll Bridge. And then ride our horse over there? Drowner. Leave me alone, homie. No one wants to see you. It's 2 a.m. Okay. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Gosh, Geralt. Just be a little nicer. Dang. Some wolf hide. Razor. Alright, let's run the rest of the way. Alright, and this is... I bet we're gonna get jumped by homie. I don't... Like, I think we made the right choice, but I don't completely trust him. You know? Go ahead then, check for traps. Bolko ought to go. 
Chap's got one lame leg already. He's not got so much to lose. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, he got me. Mm. Got some fried meat. Bad sword. One tax. A head. Nice. Well, that's it for that. And we get crowns. A letter to gate him. It's over. Soldiers have taken the school. They killed that axe on Cedric. Is for sure injured. Well, I can't say for sure. Might be alive. Might be dead. Bounties have been put on your head in my wood city center. Wow. The school's dead then? Fogred. Ghoul. Grave hag. Wonder why he didn't turn in these trophies. Maybe they tried to cheat him then, too. That was probably it, though. Poor guy. Bless him. Maybe. Alright, so that was it for that quest, though. Alright, well. We got more. Uh, to do... The tower out of nowhere, Skellige, I care more, okay. Um, nothing else in Velen. Actually, let's go and do Missing Brother, since it's... We are in Velen. Um, I bet if I go here, I'll actually find a uh, little marker. That would be nice. I got it. Marker? Survey says no. A man could only wish for a marker around here to tra fast travel. That looks like a town. Probably one I already have a marker. Sounding. Oh, I've been here. Yeah, this is actually one of the first areas of the game we went to. So it's a little north. It's uh, up at the end of the crossroads. Gotcha. Not too bad. All right, this is an in-game quest. This is uh, more our level. He, we did pick up a sword that was... Uh... Dang. Level 35. Yeah, we might use that. I don't know. New silver sword as well. Let's go and put some stuff in it. Let's just freaking poison whoever we're hitting. Why not? Um, that's kind of it, though. I'll put that in my little case for when the time comes in a little bit. Actually, I'll just keep it. I mean, I'm about to be level 35. It's a steel sword, right? Yeah. All right, missing brother. It's a contract. I'm, I'm assuming a brother's missing. What's up, Bruno? A witcher, and not a second too soon. Understand you have a contract for me. Oi, it's my brother Mickle. Been a week now since he took the women of Bellows into the hills. The women of Bellows. Bellows were a rich village, till the war passed through. Huts were burned down, larders cleared out, all the menfolk conscripted. Women were left to fend for themselves, without food nor shelter. No one wanted them. Redanians wouldn't let them into Novigrad, so Mikkel took them to the old mines, to get them out of the rain at least. And I've not had word from him since. Could look into it, if you paid me more. Halfway is normal, 
just a smidgen too high, that. 320. 320? Just a smidgen too. 310? Alright, my brother's life's at stake, so I can't skimp. It's a deal. I have so much money. Alright, I'll look for your brother. How will I recognize him? Shouldn't be hard. You were the only lad in a group of women. Corpses aren't always in a condition where I can determine the sex. Corpses? Take it back. They got lost, is all. But, if worse comes to worst, well, he had calfskin ankle boots, work of Master Clogs. Told him not to wear them into the hills. He'd only ruin them. But he was so proud of them. Think I know enough. Thanks. Well. Out we go, and let's see if we can really fast travel there. If not, it's fine. Just run it. We can ride our horse. Oh, this is the original, uh... That's one of the original places we've been uh, early in the game. Alright. It's 5.07. Looks beautiful, feeling good. We are a lot of episodes into this playthrough. And we are not close to done because we're doing both of the DLCs as well. Nothing to do with us. Cut it across, why not? Elf guard guy. You. <laughs> All right, Roach. Ooh, hello. Takes strength to do something like this. There's his boots. <laughs> yeah, tracks. not alive. But what kind of monster makes tracks like that? Maybe that's going to be our way out. The tracks pick up. That's where we came from. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Splits. Blood looks fresh, but where are the bodies? Hmm. There's one. Another victim. Maybe we've been in here. Yeah, we did have to go in the water. There's a little crate, though. Heck yeah. What could this end up being? Whoa. What just updated on final preparations? 
Wait for daylight. Gotcha. Okay. Eggs will hatch soon. Gotta destroy them. Ericus, a venomous one. So it's gonna be a mastiff spider. Food for its young. Just awesome. Young specimen. Mother can't be far. Here we are. There's the calfskin boots. A shoe bearing Master Clog's mark. All that's left of the body. Putting yourself to the sword, all the better. brother proof of what happened dang that was level 33 though so big old spider boss Thought I might be able to finish up the, uh... Okay. Odd. Thought I might be able to finish up something, but... Or the, like, eggs thing, but I guess I didn't need to. I think I can climb this and get out of here. And loot it. cutscene game <laughs> all right now we got to run back on roach nope nope get up get off the road just run what is that a bear ah bear fight Burn bear. What now, you piece of filth? Thank you. I like the roach has blinders on. <laughs> All right. right here 
but nice. So that's a contract down. Remember the times you barely pierced. Greetings. I have bad news. An Eric has killed your brother. If it's any comfort, I avenged him. Comfort? Huh. Of course it's no comfort. And I told Mikkel, why are you so eager to help strangers? Sit your arse down, or there'll be misfortune. Well, why are you still standing there? Can't get your fill of others' misfortune? No, I prefer porridge and gravy like everybody else. Pay me and I'll go buy some. I'd have paid you if you brought Mikkel back alive. I'm due a reward. Give me some coin. A reward? I. You're due. Here. For what you've done for us. Oh, nice. Friend in me, always. <laughs> Sir, boy, we're up to our noses in frights and horrors. It's some of them as mammons, coin, drakes, pikes, folk, and bats. It's not my job to help you. Okay. What did I kill out here? These Nilf Guardians? That is just barren people. Alright, well, what are we going to track next is the question. Uh, not that. Final preps. We'll get there eventually. That's uh, obviously towards the end of the game. It's called Final Preparation. So. Looks like we're going back to Care Morn for the Monster Slayer side quest. Um, which will be fun. Alright, level 34, man. We are so over-leveled for some of this stuff. I have 21,000 coins, man. We do have some more, uh... We have the DLCs we'll get to do as well, so... That'll be fun. But, uh... That's obviously a long ways out, so... We're gonna beat the whole story first before we even get into that, so... Hmm... If you like the episode, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you on the next one. I'm out.